Today is Women Veterans Day, a time to honor the major role that women have served in our military. Today is also the 73rd anniversary of women being permanently allowed to serve in the armed forces. So you know they had to mark the occasion in a really special way. News 8's Heather Hope shows us the big ceremony and the local woman awarded. The women have always served, um, but they haven't always been acknowledged for their service. June 12th, Women Veterans Day shines a light on female military achievements. This is the day we come together to show our appreciation for military women's service to our nation. In a first of its kind ceremony, the Military Women's Memorial in Arlington, Virginia, honored 10 veterans for their exemplary service with an award they can wear. The Woman of Valor brooch. And it's designed by renowned jewelry designer Anne Hand. And it's very symbolic. Um, the petals are actually a beautiful purple lavenderish color representing um, all the services, the joint forces, that is the color. Given to the 10 stellar officer and enlisted representatives from each service, the first to receive it, also from San Diego, is Captain Don Halfaker, retired Army and former military police officer. Captain Halfaker, we are honored to have you be among the first service women to receive the woman brooch, thank you. Captain Halfaker is an Iraqi Freedom Combat veteran and a Bronze Star recipient as she was wounded in 2004. When a rocket grenade hit her vehicle that she was in and she was awarded the Bronze Star from that. This recognition comes on the 73rd anniversary of the Women's Armed Services Integration Act that granted women the right to serve permanently in the military. A big year for San Diego as well as the first female Marines to complete boot camp in the Western United States did so last month. That's huge. I'm so happy. That's fantastic. I actually went through the very first company of integrated recruits for the Navy. Military Women's Memorial Executive Director Kathleen Pearl says out of 3 million women who have served our country, they only have over 300,000 registered on their website, womensmemorial.org, by going through the top tab, Create an Account. I want every woman that has served, whether it was for two years or 27 years, to take their rightful place in history. 